But did you know that in January, WWE presents the Royal Rumble, and they have announced in advance. They haven't shot an angle for it, but they're telling us in advance. On the show will be what is being called a pitch black match. At the Royal Rumble, there will be the debut of the first ever pitch black match. Now that you know that, they're going to shoot an angle that will result in a pitch black match. Why, you ask? Well, Mountain Dew apparently has a drink called Mountain Dew Pitch Black. And they got a lot of money. And I actually, you know what's funny is, uh, do you guys remember, I forget the, what, man, what uh, show it was. But they did that stupid match with Miz and the Zombies. And it was like the worst, the absolute dirt worst match. And Miz got injured on top of that. And it was stupid and embarrassing. Yes. Well, that was because of tie-in with Living Dead or whatever. I don't even remember. It was such a great tie-in, I don't remember what it was. <laughs> and, uh, you know, they, they didn't get paid that much for it. I mean, they got paid a lot. I mean, for most people here, you'd take that money. But this is a... Billion, a billion dollar company, okay? And they took chump change to ruin a pay-per-view with a horrible match. Well, that's what happens when Big Bank uh, sees much, much bigger bank in the PepsiCo Corporation or however the Yum Brands, whatever it is exactly. And that's sometimes what you feel as though you have to do. Didn't we have a Miller Lite pillow fight at uh, WrestleMania one year with Candace Michelle and somebody? Well, they, yeah, but that's different uh, because at that point they were doing that stuff all the time. Well, this was like, the thing. hey, but we're he, going to do a good show. And we're going to put a match where Miz is being eaten by zombies, yeah. and we're going to we're going to pretend it's a shoot. Well, they got the right guy involved in it. I mean, if you think about it, you wouldn't have wanted a Roman Reigns or somebody like that. The Miz was perfect for something stupid like that. I'm not advocating for it to be on TV or anything, but this is what they do. This is what this is what big places do with synergy with their corporate partners and their. Hey guys, remember that egg? What was the egg for? The egg was for a movie, right? It was another one of these. Well, they got chump change to do a bunch of stupid storylines involving an egg. Brother, get used to it. You got to do. That's how it works. You may not like it. You may not want to give deal me, with you it. You're going to give me a, a $1,000 to purposely ruin the Christmas show? Brother, I'll do that for free, number one. But number well, yeah, two, nah, you know. not worth it. You would, you, oh, of all people, Mr. Goldboat, if you somebody threw enough money in your face, you would That's the point, though, Mike. It's not enough money. It's not like they go, we'll it's give not, you $100 yes, million dollars to have Miz eaten by zombies on your pay-per-view. <laughs> That's not what they offered. Well, they're like, hey, here's a few, here's a little bit. Yeah, but here's the thing. You do something like that, so later on, down the line, maybe they'll give you a little more. Maybe they won't be so apt to bail on you because you have been working together, and this is what we did for you. But you know how this stuff works. I'm not saying it's a good thing, but you just got to suck it up and deal with it because to them, it is enough money, apparently. Well, we got a pitch black match. I don't know what the heck it is, <laughs> but we're going to get it. Oh, man. Yeah, man, what did you... See, you just can't do it right. Well, you can have a, a lights out match, but you know we're gonna be able. To, if, if we can see it, it's not pitch black. The only way to make this work and not have it be like a, a you know, false advertising, is if it's pitch black. Well, oh. Jared, put a black thing on the screen here. It's it would be like if the match light was like this for ten minutes, and all you heard was, oh, ow, boom, oh. No, Mike. Stop it. All right, you can put the thing back, Jared. That you. That is a pitch black match. If you bathe it in blue light, that ain't pitch black. If you put up a logo for Mountain Dew, that ain't pitch black. So you want this to be like the Prince of Darkness match that like Jimmy Garvin and Rick Martell or whoever it was. Was it Rick Martell and uh and Jake Roberts and then they did one with Kevin Sullivan and Jimmy Garvin for Precious or something like that back in the day. These matches where nobody can see anything. And you know what I remember about both of those matches? Uh, they were bad. They were bad. So maybe instead of just putting hoods over these guys' heads so they can't see, if it's all blacked out and nothing happens, we're actually the winners because, you know, we don't have to actually watch it. There's a lot of criticism 
about professional wrestling. You all right over there? What's going on with you? There's double the mic. Sorry. No, what do you need so much water for today? It's coffee. Put that away. Crying out loud, it's nighttime. You're not going to be able to sleep. <laughs> you have to have another drink right now. God help me. Now, where was I? People didn't like this so much, I hear. I can't even remember what I was angry about. I got a question. Is anyone else thirsty? How did I not see I'm, that? I just, uh, you absolute... Oh God, I hate everybody on this show. It's not an issue of whether the listeners can hear it. I don't care about you. It's about me. Sociopath. God. Sheesh. Me? Yeah. Now my wife is texting me, Craig. I hope you're happy about that. If you enjoy these videos, for just $7.99 per month, you can enjoy full-length editions of The Brian and Vinny Show, Wrestling Observer Live, Figure Four Daily with Tom Lawler and Lance Storm, The Mad Men Podcast, Speak Now Pro Wrestling with Denise Salcedo and more, plus hundreds of archived shows, all in beautiful HD. Don't miss out. Join us today.